how are ya? Um, last week I did not have a good week when recording my video because I forgot to hit screen record again. How great is that? It's always awesome to find out. It just makes me feel so nice, you know? Just to know that I cannot do my job properly. But I'm going to remember this time because I cannot get into the story unless I hit screen record. If I leave the screen record page open first, then I shouldn't forget no more. Then we won't have no videos without a picture. But anyways, so I won't feel so bad about being horrible. Only I can say that, okay? We're going to recap our story. I'll try because there was no pictures for me to remember. But what I could remember is... Day? Did you, did you watch the last episode? You probably didn't because I didn't screen record. So you probably just clicked out of my video, right? Pretty sure. But if you did listen to the story, they broke up. I should have let you uh, go listen to the other episode first so you can find out. But they're not together anymore because he feels that Sapphire has trust issues because of what happened with Hannah being inside of his apartment. Why? We still don't know because he didn't tell us. But he decided to break up with us. So let's get back into the story this time with a screen record and let's see what's happening now. So before I started the record, they had me customize our love interests. But before we continue our story and before we move on with the story, let's just take a moment to give a round of applause for me actually screen recording. Isn't that exciting? See, the screen record is actually here. Okay, let's get started. We can do this the easy way or the hard way. You choose. Try to scream for help. Try to push him off. Obviously, because he's muffling your mouth, your scream is not going to be as loud. Why do they have that choice as a golden choice? I don't know. But let's try to push him off. Maybe that might be a, a bad decision. We don't know. I guess you want to do this the hard way, huh? Oh. I did forget at the end of the other episode this guy did threaten our life and we don't even know who he is and what his deal is so we're finding that out right now oh did he just hit a woman do you know what they say about men who hit women hmm I'm gonna let y'all tell me this was for that slap you gave me two years ago, remember? No, we don't remember you, and we don't remember slapping anyone. Maybe Sapphire do, but no. It hurts, doesn't it? Freak you. And he thought that was funny. Oh, this is the love interest that we just um, customized. I gave him dreads. Why? Because, I don't know, Sapphire seems like a type of person who just wants to date somebody with dreads. Touch her one more time and I'll throw you alive to the sharks. I'm sure they're hungry. Mm, bad boy. Sapphire likes. Maybe that, since we customized him, maybe that might be the one with the lies and the person that Sapphire is going to lust over because we made him cute and we made him with green eyes yeah punch him back so he can remember two years ago how much it hurts get out of my sight now yeah run away oh he's so cute are you okay Oh, 
I am now, thanks to you. Look, she's already flirting. I don't know what we what would have happened if you hadn't shown up. Shh. I don't want you to think about that. And don't worry. He'll never come anywhere near you after tonight. Let's hope so. What are you going to do? Be Sapphire's bodyguard? Thank you. Or that's going to be your way of having her fall in love with you. I knew that something was up with him. What do you mean? When you walked out from the club, I noticed the way he and another guy with him were looking at you. And then he said something to his friend before leaving as well. Oh, so you followed him to see if he didn't get in some type of shenanigans? Come on, let me walk you back. Fine, yeah, just walk me back because you're going to be my hero and my, my savior and my bodyguard. Meanwhile, was that a pool? Wait, 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 wait. Meanwhile, Sapphire, why are your clothes off? Oh, oh, that's Hannah. That's Hannah and her boyfriend. <laughs> when are we going to stop hiding? I really thought that was Sapphire already getting freaky with Chase. I was about to say, like, you don't even know him like that. And you already have your clothes off, but it's Hannah. Hannah, she likes taking her clothes off for people, so it's no surprise. What do you mean? I mean, when are we going to tell our friends about us? And Sapphire, even though Sapphire won't care, but... Andrew is the one that Sapphire was wondering why he didn't like her or her presence. I don't know. Wh what? What's wrong? I don't think we should do that just yet. Why not? Because I'm afraid of Nathan's reaction. Why do you care about Nathan's reaction? Oh, because they're friends? Is that what it is? And Nathan was dating, Nathan was dating Sapphire. So maybe that's why. I don't think Nathan cares. What? Of course he cares. I'm his ex-girlfriend and you're one of his closest friends. He's engaged to Sapphire, so I don't think he gives a dang about you and me. And why do you even care about how Nathan will react? Do you still have feelings for him or what? Excuse me. Of course not. Do you? Do you not? Because don't lie. You already told Nathan or was at his apartment for one and told Nathan... So, and we're still going to figure out if your mom is sick. Because we, we do want to know that truth as well. Then why was it so important for you to tell him about your mother that night? So, is it real? Because apparently Andrew knows. You already know why. Because she really liked Nathan and I thought she should know about her being sick and i don't think that sapphire is the right girl for him why wouldn't she be give me some reasons or something bad about sapphire that would make her not a good fit for nathan they're not together anyway so but you guys don't know that well not you guys i meant these guys she'll probably end up hurting him Yet they're not together. But we don't even want Hannah to know that because who knows what the girl would do. And that's why I think we should help him out. Help him, help, help him what? Break up with air? By ruining his relationship? You should dump her and not be in a relationship with her for her even worrying about destroying somebody else's relationship. She's no good. Trust me, we'll do him a favor. Yeah, roll your eyes. 
then we can tell him about us. So, will you help me? Or more like get him to break up with Sapphire so you can get back with him and there won't be no us or them. You know what I mean? I don't know. Because you're basically going to be helping her get what she wants. Even though she doesn't know that it's already, they already broke up. I thought you said you would do anything for me. Mm -hmm. So you're using him. Little does he know. If that's true, you'll help me with this. He doesn't know. What do you say, baby? Will you help me? He doesn't know, but he's giving in. How can I say no to you? Mm-hmm. Well then, I can say it. No, Hannah. There's nothing to break up. And she's probably going to find out when she tries and to find out that they're not together in the first place. On the phone. Okay. Hey, I know it's a bit late, but I really need to talk to someone right now. Can you come over to my place? Wait, who are you talking to? Is it Sapphire? I hope it's not Sapphire. 30 minutes later. Thanks for coming. That's definitely not Sapphire the moment I seen brown hair. It wasn't purple or violet. Alyssa, for you, I'll come in the middle of the night. Um, Nathan, who is this? Since you're my friend, oh, your cousin. Your cousin. So, what's going on? I broke off the engagement with Sapphire. Mm-hmm. You did what? Are you insane? Why would you do such a thing? <sighs> what happened? It must be something serious. Well, not that serious. Yeah, because you broke up with her because you thought she didn't trust you. I wonder why having Hannah in your apartment, she doesn't, imagine, imagine your boyfriend was in his apartment and you went to go visit him. And the first thing when he opened his door, you find that his ex-girlfriend is in the back. No one called you. No one said that, oh, Hannah, you know, no, my ex-girlfriend's coming over and we're just going to talk about something. And you just see that. You would think something too, right? So he over-exaggerated. He, he overreacted. It's because of her trust issues. We've been dating for two years and she still thinks that I would do something behind her back. You invited your ex-girlfriend over and you didn't tell her. How did that look? What did you do? That's the thing. I didn't do anything wrong, but you must have done something. Otherwise, she wouldn't think like that. Thank you. Thank you, Alyssa. See, at least someone has a brain. I was comforting Hannah at Andrew's birthday party and Sapphire saw that and she went crazy. You were comforting Hannah? See, even your cousin knows you're not, that, that's, it's not right. There's ways to do stuff. You don't comfort your ex-girlfriend by hugging her. Unless it was you and your girlfriend's decision to be friends with your ex. But other than that, Sapphire did not like Hannah. As in your ex, Hannah? She told me that her mother is sick. She has cancer. And that's the only reason why I comforted her. Oh, that's that's all but that's not all 
She showed up here at my place the day after Andrew's birthday party, uninvited, and I was so pissed at her for doing that. But then she started crying and saying she has no one to talk to except me. Mm-hmm. Hannah doesn't have no one else. With, her boyfriend is Andrew. So why would she not have nobody else to talk to? No. That don't sound right. That just, it doesn't make sense at all. So I kind of let her stay for a while. Big mistake. You let her stay? What was I supposed to do? Kick her out? Yeah, nicely though. Anyway, then Sapphire had to show up while she was here. And let me guess, she was not happy about it because I wouldn't be happy either. She was pissed. Well, you can't blame her. I would be too if I were in, in her shoes. Thank you, every woman would. But I didn't do anything with Hannah. It doesn't matter. You said it yourself. She has trust issues. Then you shouldn't be doing things like that without her knowing anything. Exactly. What happened to phone? What happened to your phone? What happened to calling her? Saying, hey, you know, um, I'm in my bathroom right now. Hannah showed up unexpectedly. So um, what do I do? Sapphire, on the other hand, probably would have said, uh-uh. She needs to leave. That's what you need to do. Kick her out. Mm hmm And to be honest, I don't trust Hannah. See, not even your cousin trusts Hannah. So you being mad at Sapphire for not trusting her, your own cousin don't trust her. You should be careful when it comes to her. Mm hmm She's plotting stuff. And when it comes to Sapphire... I don't think breaking up with her was a right decision from you. It wasn't at all. Break off an engagement for your mistakes. Meanwhile, meanwhile, Sapphire's already talking to another hot guy. So you either get back with her quickly for your mistakes if she takes you back. Or lose her to the um, Chris a hunk. Thanks for walking me back. It was my pleasure. Anyway, I gotta go now. Will you be okay by yourself? She should. I'll be fine. My friend and her boyfriend are here some somewhere. Okay then. Have a lovely evening. Look, she's already blushing. Sapphire, did you forget about Nathan that quickly? By the way, by the way what? You never told me your name. Why you want to know her name, huh, Chase? Unless you want to get to know her further. Uh, you know your name. You never asked. It's Sapphire. Sapphire. Pretty name. Well, thank you. Thank you. I'm Chase. Nice to know. Good night, Sapphire. Mm -hmm. She already going to have dreams tonight about not Nathan, but Chase. The next day, I decided to call Natalie today and meet up with her because I really needed to talk to her about what's been going on. Like you talking to Chase and you might have a crush on him. Oh, and that you and Nathan are not engaged nor together anymore. You didn't tell her none of that, have you? Oh, I need to tell you something. Tell me what? Ian told me that he has a surprise for me tonight. I'm really curious of what it could be. 
Maybe it's a romantic date. Or what if he's going to propose? You think so? We'll see. You really think it could be that? Maybe. Then both of us are going to be engaged. Both of you guys? Um, no, Natalie. Sapphire is no longer engaged. I'm sorry, but she's going to break that news to you pretty quickly. I'm excited right now. I wish the time could go faster. I tried hard to hold back the tears. But as soon as she asked me what's wrong, I couldn't stop those tears. Why do that always happen? It's like we're always okay. And we're not gonna we all we're always okay and not gonna cry until somebody asks what's wrong, and then all of a sudden the tears just wanna flow like a waterfall. Why does that happen? Sapphire, what's wrong? Nathan broke up with me. He did what? Why? What happened? And then I told her everything about it. Yeah. So, oh, Sapphire, I'm so sorry to hear that. And I'm so sorry for not being there for you last night. It's okay. You didn't know. Why didn't you say anything about this last night? I didn't want to talk about it in front of Ian. Is Ian Nathan's friend too? I can't remember. But it's just for a short while, right? It's not like it's over for good. You two will be back together in no time. Um, That's up to Nathan if he gets to Sapphire fast enough before Chase does. But she haven't told you that part yet, Natalie. That's if Nathan wants to bring it back on you. He better hurry up. What did I say? Last, next day, last day? Um, something. What can my sister possibly want now? Oh, we haven't met Sapphire's sister. Megan, what's up? Hey sis, what are you doing? Nothing. I'm I'm at home. Why? Do you want to go out with me and Jenny? Out where? To the club. Oh, I don't know. Come on, it's better than staying at home and feeling sorry for yourself. And who knows, maybe you'll see that hot mysterious stranger again. Oh, so did you tell your sister about Chase? You must have. Hot, mysterious stranger again? You told her. LOL, Megan? Haha, <laughs> what? No, but seriously, you should come with us. It'll be fun. Okay, but we're not going to see Nathan there, are we? Fine, I'll come but only because I'm bored. Whatever you say, sis. Well, I guess Sapphire is going to go to a club. Don't drink too much drinks, Sapphire. Stay sober. What do you want to wear? Outfit one. Do you just have this outfit in every color? Let's look at another one. Two. Uh, is that pretty enough? Let's look at the last one. Oh, we'll wear this one, even though you can't find an outfit to match your hair. It's like hard, but we're going to choose this outfit because it's cute. Now let's do the hair and makeup. No, you're not taking your braids out. It's not time. It's not time yet. You take your braids out when I say it's time. So we look amazing and let's go. Oh, and you can't do your makeup either because your hair. So are we just going to stand here like mannequins or go and dance? Oh, that's your sister, Sapphire. 
You chose violet hair and your sister has black hair. And who's Jenny? I say dance. What about you, sis? I'd rather stay here. Gosh, you're so boring. Come on, Jenny. Is that Megan's best friend or something? Megan, you better not be. Well, well. Well, well, well to you if it isn't Mr. Kian. It better not be the same Kian from the other. You've got to be kidding me. What a lovely surprise to see you here tonight. It's been a while. Been a while? We never met you. Sorry. Have you missed me? She looking like, do I know you? I was hoping to never see you again. Ouch, that hurts. Oh, how did you just magically get a scar out of nowhere? Because her words, they don't physically mean that. As I was looking at him, I noticed some bruises on his face. And I couldn't help but wonder what happened to him. Oh, I forgot. Kian did get Kian did get hurt. Was it was it him in that car crash? I think it was him. Yeah. Forgot. See? I forgot. Why are you looking at me like that? Ask him what the what are the bruises? Don't ask you don't care. We don't care. Am I that irresistible? No. You're not. But Chase is. You know, I was a bit upset when you never came to hear me out that night. You're still thinking about that? Yes, I'm still thinking about that. I'm pretty sure the only thing you wanted to do that night was try to seduce me. Yeah, because that's what he did to Mia. Seduce her over and over and over again. How you and him got connected, we still don't know. And what's so bad about that? Um, A lot of things, especially if Sapphire doesn't want it. What are you doing? I can't help it that you attract me that much. He said as he ran his fingers through my hair. Kim, back up. We're not doing this at all. No other woman has ever attracted me the way you do. Oh, you mean not Mia? Tell him to back off and that's what we're doing. Back off, Ken. Chill. You know, Sapphire is the feisty one, okay? She's not like Mia. I, you got to tell us how you're you're even connected with Sapphire. And here I was thinking that maybe I made a mistake by breaking up with you. Yet we don't even remember being in a relationship with you, Ken. I can't believe you right now. It just trips me out how Ken and Nathan looks exactly alike. Just the hair is slightly different. Nathan, that isn't it. it this isn't what it looks like. Of course not. Because when it comes to you, it never is. But it's true. Sapphire didn't do anything wrong. If you want to blame someone, you should blame me. But yet, why do Nathan care? You are not together with Sapphire anymore. You broke it off, remember? Is everything okay, Nathan? Mm -hmm. Andrew, don't you have secrets of your own to tell? You know, like you dating Hannah? I changed my mind. Huh? What is he talking about? I'm coming with you and those two girls. What? Let's go then. Nathan, what are you doing? Weren't you not going to tell her what are you doing? Nathan! And she's running after him. Of course. 
Somewhere deep down in Sapphire's heart, she still loves Nathan. Why wouldn't she? Nathan, wait. Don't do this. Say something. I did nothing wrong. You have to believe me. What if I don't want to believe you? Okay. What? You know me and you know I would never cheat on you. Wait, are we having a flashback because you're not together? We must be having a flashback. You have to believe me, Nathan. Or is she dreaming? I don't know. This is confusing me now. I don't believe you. You, you don't mean that. How does it feel, Sapphire? How does it feel to not trip? You guys are not together. What is this? What is this conversation you guys are having? Nathan! Are you okay? Kim, go away. Go away. Gosh. You cause enough. You always cause them problems. Yeah, let's just all stand in the rain, look sad, and cry. Well, that's the end of our episode. Nothing juicy has happened in that episode. But we can give props to me actually recording, right? I actually screen record. Yeah. So um, that last part kind of confused me because they're not together anyway. So I don't know how, in a way, how Sapphire is cheating or why Nathan is so angry. I don't know. Can we clarify that part in the next episode, please? Yes. Thank you. I would greatly appreciate that. But other than that, um, Sapphire slightly has a crush on Chase, which I don't know. Maybe, maybe Chase might treat her better. Maybe Nathan wants to get back with her or maybe Nathan never completely broke it off. I don't know. I don't know. This episode is confusing. So... We're just going to have to wait till the next episode and see what happens then. But if you did enjoy this episode today, give this video a like. It will help my channel out so much. Don't forget to become a Rare Breed fan. We have to grow our family. We have to, we have to grow big. I want to make it to at least 100 subscribers. Can we, can we get up to that and more? Well, I'm just asking for 100. But other than that, growing my family, don't forget to hit that bell button either because you don't want to miss another juicy, juicy story.